really. Sorry, guys. Um, I know I'm as white as this wall, so you might not be able to tell it's me. That's what it was. Hey. <laughs> um, today, this video is going to be really late because uh, I've had a bad night and a pretty bad day. Um, most of you know that I suffer from depression, and it was just one of those nights and one of those beginnings of the day. So, that's why this video is pretty late. Today I wanted to talk about something that has thing to do with my depression. Mainly I wanted to talk about that, um, I know a lot of people are like me and don't like to talk to people about why they're upset or whatever. And, uh, something that's really helped me that, uh, you might not think would help is making YouTube videos. I know a lot of people would tell people who have depression or self-esteem issues not to get on the internet, not to make videos because people are going to be mean to you. Well, in fact, I've met the nicest people since I started doing YouTube. They are all very supportive and very nice, um, and they've helped me a lot with trying to get over my fears and stuff, and um, getting my thoughts out there, whether I think somebody wants to listen or not, because not a lot of people want to listen to what I have to say. Not through any fault of their own, it's just they have their stuff going on, or I just don't like talking about it. So this is my way of talking through my stuff in a way that could also help others, and just gets it out there, whether one person sees it or nobody sees it. That way, it's kind of like writing a letter and burning it, because people may see it, people may not see it, it doesn't matter as long as you got your thoughts out there. So this is something that I liked. And what did you tell people about? I mean, if you have depression and stuff and you have a bad day, get on here, make a YouTube video out of it, or even if you don't talk about it, just make a YouTube video, and you will feel amazing because you're, you could be helping somebody else while you're depressed. And it's just like, holy shit, I can actually do something. I can do something that I feel accomplished after doing, and it takes just putting a video on the internet. Woo! I don't know, it's just... I haven't been in a good headspace lately, and... I don't know what it is. I honestly don't. There's just some times where I get down, and... There's really nothing nobody can do or say to bring me back up. And I just deal with it until it goes away. And I know that upsets people because they can't help. But this is why I don't talk to people about it because I can't just sit there and say, well, you can't do anything because that just makes me sound like a dick. Like, uh, I don't want you to help me, blah, 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 blah. But uh, it's just the fact that, you know, it's my depression. Um, with all the stuff that's happened to me, it's not something that somebody does or says that gets to me. It's just a lot of things that happen at once. I mean, somebody, I could stop talking to somebody, and it's not their fault I'm depressed, but that along with, you know, I haven't done anything today, um, I haven't talked to this person in a while, or my games aren't uploading, or something. It's just it's a mix of everything that just gets me down. And it's not what one person does or what one person says. It has nothing to do with the people. And I don't I, I don't know how to explain to people that it's not your fault that I'm depressed. It's not your job to come to me and talk to me about it. It's your job just to be my friend. And to understand that sometimes I will get like this and just to let me deal with it in my own way. Because there's really nothing that anybody can do except just tell me they're there for me and, you know, listen if I want to talk about it. And if not, just act like nothing's wrong. I know that sounds pretty callous to act like nothing's wrong, but if you keep acting like they're going to hurt themselves or do something stupid, they're going to think about doing it because um, it's just on their mind and it's on your mind and it, it doesn't help. And because I used to cut, I'm not afraid to admit it, and I had one of my episodes of wanting to cut last night, and I texted one of my best friends about it, and it's 
instead of being like, you know, you should do it, blah, 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 she just asked me why and just wanted to make sure that I didn't, but she didn't, like, yell at me for it. She knows that it's not something that I can control, and she knows that it's something I have to deal with, and she wanted to make sure it was nothing somebody said or did to me, because then she'd go off, but... <laughs> Shout out to Kayla. Hey. <laughs> um, then it's just like people. There are some people that understand, like she does, and those are the people that you need to have in your corner when things go wrong. And it's always easy to find those people, as much as people don't believe that. You just gotta give somebody a chance. Um, gotta give everybody a chance, honestly. Just because somebody says something or they seem different to you is not a reason to not talk to that person or whatever. Because I was one of those people that um, I was quiet. I didn't do anything. You know, so people thought I was weird because I was so quiet and stuff. And people still, and they talked to me and now they're my best friends. And they see what kind of person I actually am because I am shy and I don't put myself out there. As weird as that is, seeing as how I'm making a YouTube video, but it's the truth. <laughs> like I said, if you're depressed and stuff, make a YouTube video. It doesn't have to be about depression. It doesn't have to be about anything. It's just something creative that you can do. That's it's just not easy to do, but it's not exactly hard. So it's just something that you can accomplish every day. I mean. You can make a video every day, and that can be your one thing that you do a day that can make you feel better. Because I know when I get stuff accomplished, it makes me feel better. So, even if it's just making a, a one-minute video a day, it doesn't have to be about anything. Just make a video, put it online, and people looking at it and liking it and stuff like that is it's gonna it's gonna boost your mood. Now there will be times when nobody looks at it, and you gotta understand that. Not everybody likes the same things you do. Not, they're not going to like every video you make. They're not going to like everything you do or say. So, there's going to be times when your videos aren't going to be as good. Well, they're not bad. They're just not going to be what somebody likes and nobody's going to watch it. Or only a few people are going to watch it. you got to give it time. Not everybody can see what you're doing. And not everybody that could like what you're doing can see it. So give yourself time. Give yourself space. Give me space. No. <laughs> Just do what you like. And eventually it'll all come full circle. I don't know. This is a bunch of rambling. But I feel like it needed to be said. It's one of my outlets. And I don't have many. Due to my cutting and stuff. I don't have any because I quit doing that. And I don't know any other good outlets besides exercise, which I'm in now because I exercised yesterday. Now, which I need to do again today. <sighs> need to work out. <laughs> As you can see, just doing this video is uplifting my mood. I may not seem like it, but I can seem like it. Like, I'll be all jokey and stuff. So, that has boosted my mood. The video. Like this. Yes, like this. So, if anybody knows what I'm talking about, leave a like. Leave a comment. We can discuss. If you don't want to talk about your personal problems in an online forum, you can message me on any platform. I'm willing to listen. I am a very good listener. I just don't like talking. So, there's that. But anyway. If you like the video, leave a like, comment. We can have a discussion. This is what I'm here for. I want to be friends. I want to meet people. Yes. And, uh, subscribe if you haven't already. If you want to, no pressure. I'm not gonna like stalk you or something. It's weird. Very weird. Why did I bring that up? I don't know. But, uh, this is Rose signing off, and I hope you all have a good day.